Okay, guys, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there is a bird's nest over there. See that little ball? It's a bird's nest. I think it's something like that maple. I think that this is where, like, this stuff coming out of this um, tree. Oh, yeah, look at that birch. It's like a nice silver birch. It has a little black, kind of like little patches on, on its part. It's right there. You see that? That's not There's a tree paper over there next to it. But there is some weird stuff coming out of it. So, I don't know if it's sap. I don't know what this is. But it's like kind of sticky. It looks sticky. I don't know if it's like a nest or something. Or like, it's like this is a maple. There should be lots of intro bugs over here. But the coat, I think it killed them. Most of them. But I'm walking home. It's a nice video. Yeah, you got more plants. With that. Yes. Okay. 335. I got more spruce trees. These are bird's nest spruce. Like I said, they don't grow that big. But that might be an apple. Okay, we're crossing the street. Oh, this is coming from. Come on, we gotta go. This is a silver vehicle. Okay, this is an apple. Okay, look at this apple tree we have. Yeah, this one produces a lot, quite a few apples. So possibly I don't see really any insects over here. Look at these apples. It's hanging. Look at the little cook out right here. This is another spruce right here. Okay, this is the other spruce tree over there. This is the horse chestnut tree. Which in the spring, in the summer, it produces like these beautiful flowers and, these, and, and attached to the flowers are like the nuts, the, horse, the chestnuts. So that's pretty cool. We got the Japanese maple. That's the most insects in it. And then we got the oak sap, and I think it's the leaves are starting to die.